Oh, this is going to be good. Yes. Welcome to Swerve's house. The following contest is a tables match. Making his way to the ring from Tacoma, Washington. Weighing in at 201 pounds. The NXT North American Champion, Isaiah Swerve Scott. The unmistakable swag of Isaiah Swerve Scott on display. Uh, Byron, he has the talent to back it up. Saxon, why don't you learn from Swerve Scott? This guy is cool, man. Everything about him is cool. You should take notes. I thought I already had a cool factor. The swagger of Isaiah Swerve Scott has earned him love from the WWE Universe, but some say it borders on arrogance. Yeah, but when you're as good as Swerve is, you have to show it off. About to see great high-flying and striking hybrid offense. And his opponent from Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 249 pounds, Jake the Snake Roberts. There is nothing but pure evil in the eyes of Jake the Snake Roberts. A rare superstar who seeks no adoration, yeah. only fear. Yes. You know, Jake the Snake Roberts, creator of one of the most devastating moves, the DDT. So sudden, so powerful. That maneuver has brought the Snake much success. You have to go for that first fall early and get the advantage in a match like this. Am I correct, Corey? Actually, the best strategy is to land the first two falls so you can call it a night. <laughs> Thanks, Corey. That was insightful. That's better than anything you ever come up with, Saxton. Anyway, the last thing you want to do is split the first two falls, and then the pressure mounts. Take care of your business early and end the entry. Something tells me that's not easy. There he goes, right into the corner. Ooh. Oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. So ruthless. Uh oh. An arm breaker. Ooh, a sharp kick. The thing about a tables match is you can't really avoid contact with a table unless you can set up a table with telekinesis. But you have to be hyper aware of your surroundings because this match can end instantly. That's right, Corey. The only time you should be preparing a table is when your opponent is truly incapacitated. Mistake made by Swerve. He's going for it all. From the top. Are you kidding me? And Roberts is taking control in this match. This is Jake at full throttle. Turning the tables. Tombstone and route. Blackboard! Wow. Oh, what a kick. Oh, my God. The death lock is in. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Nowhere to go. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? He climbs into the ring. Whatever's plan here can't be good. Delivering a series of sharp elbows. Whoa, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Swerve is one step quicker. Haymaker connects. Oh boy, jump and suplex released. And now a series of stomps and kicks. Jake just getting knocked around. Yeah, Jake has to plot a way to get back into this. 
Back into the ring. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Short jab. It's raining down those shots to the back of the neck. That's just a beatdown. He's taking this to the floor now. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Oh, Roundhouse connects. He's absorbed some damage already. This one is headed outside, guys. Of all the toys underneath the ring, he just had to go with the one that ensures splinters. Close fist connects. Oh. Into the ring now. He'll head to the ring. can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. Oh, right knee lift. It burned an atomic drop. Ooh. Rich in the arm. Oh, man, what a clothesline. but the added pain of going through a table is insult to injury. This victory is exactly the kind of statement I knew he wanted to make here. This was a message from him to the entire WWE Universe. <laughs>